So my father decided 20 years ago to open this tiny little coffee shop from the warehouse of my grandfather's shop. And it was all this vision from traveling in Europe and like seeing, watching, seeing markets in Europe, like how they they do it, like the the mix between this traditional, very very traditional market and new businesses like coffee shops and bars and stuff like that. So that was his vision. Um, so we worked for that. He sent my sister to the Cordon Bleu in Paris to learn how to be a pastry chef, and she came back and started making croissants and brioches. And I remember myself as a kid, you know, running around. We started with this tiny shop, and with time, we grew up to three shops right next to each other, and we opened. We changed it a little bit every few years, and then uh, then we opened uh, Casino de Paris. Uh, another project of my father, also like a vision, because this place was a bordel, like a whorehouse, in the days of the, the mandate uh, with the British. And it was the whole complex, the whole building. Um, so he decided he, wants, he wanted to make something that would uh, be similar. Uh, not exactly the same thing, because we can, but uh, we, we restored the place, we used the original tiles on the floors, um, we used the menus in Hebrew, in Arabic, and English to be a multicultural, multilingual establishment um, to welcome everybody the same as it was in the Mandate days. Uh, it was a place for the dignitaries, the British dignitaries, the Israeli, the Jewish dignitaries, and the Muslim dignitaries that came to have fun. So that was the whole idea of the vision and behind this wall. Our family in the market. Shana Tova! Shana Tova! Happy New Year! This is my favorite story, Daphne. Let's tell you the story of my father. Because he was a big boy. 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 He was a big boy.